Alright, what is up guys, it's your boy Pacer here and I'm bringing you a brand new video on something that is... I don't even know. But, um, for a quick example, we are driving on the highway and, um, he tells me to peer off to the left and drive on the rumble strip. And I put up with the biggest fucking argument that I should have never put up with, like... I, he said that it's part of it. I'm like, what do you mean part of it? And he's like, it's just part of the experience. I'm like, I'm trying to learn how to drive, not to learn how to die. Or some shit like that. And it was like, I was not even comfortable with doing it, like, whatsoever. So, we're going on the highway. We're flying about 80 mile an hour. Now, let's think of the things that could have happened. I could have lost control of the car. Because at first, he told me to slow down. At first, he told me to slow down. And I'm just like, wait. I meant, I thought you were, like, not supposed to slow down on the highway. Because uh, we were slowing down. I was going 40 on the highway. And, like, everyone's passing me, and I'm looking like a dumbass and shit. It's like, it's, I don't understand what goes to this dude's head and he, on top of it he's annoying as fuck um what just happened to my body we'll be like driving and he like distracts me and shit and like, he's also a weirdo too because right now i'm texting like a gorgeous girl i mean she's gorgeous blonde nice body everything i mean i know her i've described her and stuff like that but um just the, what he said i don't even want to say it Oh my god, he, he's like in his 50s, and he says, is she good looking? I'm like, like my, my facial expression was like, oh uh, yeah, and I was like, what the fuck? So I got a creep, I got an annoying fuck, a crazy driver's ed teacher, I'm dead serious, it's, it's weird. Like, I'm not even comfortable with it. When I... My stomach turns when I have to go drive with this dude. Like, I'm not even that bad of a driver, but... It's just the fact that he's annoying as fuck. Like, I literally... I get... When I get annoyed, I don't talk. I just, like... If you say something, I'm just gonna sit there and just laugh. Like, fake laugh, I guess you could say. Cause still, like, make some stupid jokes. And I'm just, like, sitting there fake laughing. I hope he doesn't see these videos, dude. Cause he's gonna hate me forever. But that's okay. He's a retired police officer, too. So, I'll probably whoop my ass. I was kidding, no. I could literally outrun that fool. Um, but the one thing that we did talk about that actually kind of meant something was weight loss. And I was like, yeah, I used to be excellent. I used to be 205 pounds, while I weigh 172, and stuff like that. And basically, I'm like, yeah, we, we went on and we went on and on. And he was like, well, I'm 100 pounds overweight and stuff like that. The doctor says I'm not. Yeah, yeah, the doctor says not. Yeah. And I'm just like over here, and I'm just like, I'm glad I lost all the fucking weight. And, like, I, I kind of feel sorry for him at the same time, but then it's, like, it's his problem. Like, he blamed it on himself for being the weight that he is. So, that's, like, the only conversation that actually meant something to me. Other than that, he rambles on about nothing, and it's, like, it's just annoying. He'll, like, make some stupid joke or some shit, and, like, he'll distract me because we were driving along, like, a main road or whatever and we had to like merge like you had to merge into the left lane i didn't see the sign because he was too busy talking and it kind of like it, it just like it really offends me when because if you guys are new to my channel if you guys have not watched my day in the life video i do drive a bmw we're sitting on a stoplight i'm driving a ford uh focus i mean i don't have a problem with it it's not a big deal um, no, I mean, I don't like to brag about it and stuff like that. I don't even like to talk about it. You know, if people ask me what kind of car do I drive, I'm obviously going to say it. But other than that, I don't ever talk about it. I, I just don't think it's, like, the right thing to do. But, um, we're stopped at a stoplight, a black Suburban. I mean, it was a nice, it was kind of like an Escalade, but it wasn't an Escalade. Um, pulls up to us, and he's like, that's what you need instead of a BMW. I was like, okay, do you, if I had, like, a, oh. I thought that was sharp in my fucking game, but it's not. Um, but I was just like, I didn't choose the car, I didn't even bring it up, I didn't do anything, they just got it for me. So, I mean, it was, I think it's just really annoying when people just do that kind of shit to you. 
now. It's just whatever. Ooh, that triple speed though. But um, it's just whatever. You just, it's just creepy, annoying, scary. He makes me do shit that I'm uncomfortable with. Um, on we were going to stop at a rest stop, right? Instead of parking, so say like right here's a parking spot. I'm a car, right? Instead of parking like normal, he says park vertical to the sidewalk. So this entire thing is sidewalk, right? I'm basically parked like this while everyone else is parked like a normal person would park. Like if you're out on the main street of main street of your city, and like there's like cars like parked normal. I was taking up three parking slots because the car was vertical to the sidewalk. And I'm sitting here looking like an idiot. Everyone's looking at me. I have a student, uh, my car, the car that they had, the AAA car, it's a student driver on the back, student driver on the side. It's just really irritating. Like, I'm making myself look like a bad driver and I'm not even that bad. I've been on the interstate before. If you guys are getting ready to drive, don't even be afraid of the interstate. I'm telling you that right now. It's nothing to be afraid of. People just over exaggerate it. Uh, just pay attention and you'll be just fine. But un it's just annoying. He just does not stop talking. Non-stop. I mean, if I can understand him talking about like the important things, but the things that are not important should just go. So I just wanted to give like a little rant. It's been six minutes. I wasted enough of you guys' this time. Um, I just believe that, you know, if I'm driving, just especially if you're annoying, he is just and then you're talking about nothing that I care about just please just be quiet so I don't get into a car crash because I have a feeling that he's gonna talk to me the next time and I ha and I'm just gonna like do something wrong I just have that disgusting feeling so anyways that's been a rant I about we'll throw that kid but anyways thank you guys so much for stopping by thank you guys for 500 subscribers I just had to get that out and what the hell um, all my social media will be down in the description below. Make sure you guys follow me on Snapchat so that way you guys can keep up with where I'm at. You guys would have definitely seen the part where I was like parked uh, vertical on the sidewalk or parallel to the sidewalk, whatever. So yeah, you guys would have seen that. Um, so make sure you guys add me because this is my this is gonna be my last day with we'll driving and I have something I have a feeling something's gonna go wrong. So make sure you guys add me on Snapchat. Instagram, Twitter, whatever it may be. Come watch my stream. I stream on Mondays, Tuesdays, uh, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays on MLG TV. So make sure you guys come check me out on that. Make sure you guys follow the stream. As always, it's been your boy Pacer. Thank you guys.